Hello and welcome back to another Vlogmas vlog. We've literally just premiered the previous one. So this should be Vlogmas vlog five. And coming up in this vlog, we've got some amazing illuminated tractors to show you that we filmed, how long ago? About a couple of weeks ago? Yeah, roughly a couple of weeks ago. Um, so Matt is cooking uh, some of the delicious Hello Fresh food, and I'll show you what we're gonna have in a second. So what's this one? This is a Cajun chicken thing with mashed potato. I can't we, see the thing. Did we have it before? It was yes. nice. Creamy tomato Cajun chicken with spinach and mashed potato. It was gorgeous. We've also got some roast carrots. Yeah. And oh yeah, and you bought some of things for Christmas dinner as well. I did. There was a bargain there was in a Morrison. Nineteen P if you've got your more card. For a bag of a bag of carrots or a bag of parsnips or a swede or a bag of sprouts. Wow. That's a bargain. So we've got some. They'll keep until Christmas Day. In fact, we haven't actually got a lot to buy now for Christmas Day. Oh, because... no, I made a list of stairs. We do. Oh, is there? <laughs> is there? What do we need? Uh, we need things like bacon, onions, oh, yeah. sprouts. We need more butter. Uh... Are, we, are you making your own pigs in blankets? No, your mum's bringing them. Oh, she's bringing them, isn't she? I forgot. Mm. I forget because because we're having a family Christmas, different people are bringing different things. Like my mum's bringing her parsnip puree and stuffing. Um, we've already got some desserts that were given to us. We've yeah. got some champagne, not champagne, Prosecco that was given to us. Um, so what, so we need some, oh, the bacon goes on the turkey, doesn't it? Does it does go on top of the turkey to keep it all nice and moist. Yeah. Oh, so, so there are things we need. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll have to go in the week to get those, I think. Yeah. Hello and welcome to a new vlog. And the sun is shining. It's really, really bright. And we're by a canal. <laughs> we're in Matt's hometown yeah. of Welshpool. We're going to... Have a look up the high street and then we are seeing some illuminated tractors. Yay. So here is part of the canal. It's Montgomeryshire Canal. Montgomeryshire Canal. So here is some of the high street. Uh, there are lots of old buildings in Welshpool. Yeah. Lots of Georgian. Um, I think it's mostly Georgian and Victorian, isn't it really? Yeah, this was my dentist. Oh yeah, that was that was a dentist. Okay, so there's Molly's sweet shop. And this is more of the high street. There's also a Methodist church, and Matt thinks he was baptised here. And there's the rest of the high street all the way up. So I think we're going to walk down because it's just started to rain. So we're going to go to Matt's parents and have a pit stop. And then it's the illuminated tractor run. Okay, going for a passage on the way. Little cute um, pubs and shops and all kinds of things that we found on our way back. Oh, and there's some. <laughs> Look at these. Wow. We're waiting for the tractor. Yay. <laughs> In the rain. Yeah. It's raining. Boo. Okay, here they come. Are we ready for some illuminated tractors? 2023. They're supposed to be even better than last year. I think there was over 200 last year. And they're supposed to be even more this year. So if anyone's feeling like counting and you get to the end of the video, tell us how many tractors there actually were. We've got a really good spot on the island. See them all coming down. There's definitely a lot of lights on them. <laughs> so some of them are, are sponsored by companies.
Oh, look at this one coming out. <laughs> I recognize that. They're going quite fast. <laughs> oh, look at this little one. Oh, it's so sweet. Look at this. Beep your horns. Oh, this one's got a really colourful trailer coming up. Look at this. Wow. Oh, it's got people on it. <laughs> Give them away. Right, I have no idea what number we're up to yet, so I hope you've all been counting.
wasn't a tractor. He was masquerading as a tractor. So I don't know whether or not you came to the one that wasn't a tractor as a tractor. comes the next way. I love the little dinky small ones, they're really, really cute. And a Christmas tree on the back as well. Very, very, very cute. Okay. It's raining quite badly now. But we'll persevere. Oh, look at here. He wasn't illuminated, does he count? No. He was not illuminated, he just had a flash of light. He is illuminated, he's got a few on his um, <laughs> on his back shoulder. Definitely illuminated. Look at all those lights. Oh, oh well, look at that. Okay, this is the last one. Okay, I think the fire engine signals the last tractor. So that's all of them. How many did you count? Excluding that one that was not a tractor. We missed some. So we're back. We pulled over. We're going to get some more of them.
¿Está bien? It is, it's the Christmas bird. Yay! Always love a bit of Fanny at Christmas. Hello, and welcome to my little series on Christmas know-how. Oh my goodness, it's the 19th of December and they have just arrived. It's my cards. Right, I'm going to try and do this one-handed. This is not going to work. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. They've finally got here. Yay! Here it is, our Christmas card for 2023. It's finally... This should have been here two weeks ago. Oh, it's lovely. And so I've got 20 of these for friends and family and patrons. Wow, didn't that picture turn out really well? And then on the reverse... Oh, that looks fantastic. Now that they're here, all is forgiven because that's a beautiful card. I absolutely love it. That's fantastic. Yay, I'm so pleased. I am so happy. I finally got my Christmas cards written and these are the ones that I need to post. I'm then going to call up my parents, drop off their Christmas card and pick up all the things I need to record my Christmas speech here later tonight. There we go, that's all the international and UK cards posted. Yay, result! There we go, hand delivering. There we go, hand delivering some more cards in the village. Look at these roasted vegetables and sausages. Don't they look gorgeous? And we've got some potatoes as well to go with them. <gasps> yum, 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 yum. There it is, and there is some sauce to go on as well. So there's what is being described as a buttery sauce going on. Mm. Hi everybody and welcome to Wednesday the 20th. I've just had my hair done, Matt's had his done as well. Um, we are about to go a little bit of Christmas food shopping and also a little bit of present delivering, uh, which I've just wrapped. And then we need to come home and I need to work. I got my Royal Reviewer Christmas message done. I don't know if I've already mentioned that, but that's done. It's in the can. It's all uploaded and ready to go. This year, I'm having, I'm putting the message out on Royal Reviewer and on the Elliot and Matt channel simultaneously at 3.15 on Christmas Day. So if you want to listen to my alternative Christmas message then uh, tune in after the king because I don't want to compete with his majesty so I am respectfully going after the king so the king will be at 3 p.m <laughs> here in the UK I will be going uh, my video will be going live at 3 15 so make a note in your diaries my lovies I'm going to Morrison's to do some Christmas food shopping got sprouts mint sauce cranberry sauce I think we've got everything. Yay! Yeah, let's get it like on the wire. No, let's get it on the till and pay for. We're back from the supermarket and there's a lot of things to put away. So we're not going to do a big food haul, uh, but all the Christmas food is there. Um, I think we've got everything. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Let's get putting it all away. Also, thank you very, very much to my auntie Margaret and Jennifer, who very kindly gifted us this beautiful black cat and moon ornament for the tree in memory of Molly. So I think that's going to be really gorgeous. And it can go with can go with the star that we've already got. So I'm going to find a really nice spot for this on the tree. Hi everyone, it is the 21st of December and it's been a work day for me. I've got a Royal Reviewer video filmed. I'm uploading it now, about to release it once it goes through all the checks. It's been a windy day. It's been incredibly windy. Um, I think there's some kind of storm going on. Um, it's a, the first I heard of it was this morning when I woke up and I could hear the wind howling in the trees and there was banging going on and all sorts of things. So yeah, windy day. So the cats, the boys have not been very happy with the weather. Rory's on the bed. Bo's been coming in and out and he's finally settled. <laughs> and he's had three pouches of food today. Very hungry little munchkin. Uh, I need to open some advents and catch up on some chocolates. I need to catch up on the chocolates. Uh, now, to a bit of sad news. Uh, tomorrow, we were supposed to be meeting friends 
uh, down in Milton Keynes. We were going to do a bit of shopping, see some festive Christmas lights. There was one thing I overlooked when we sort of booked in <laughs> to do all of this was that tomorrow's Friday, it's the last Friday before Christmas, I woke up to an article that 16 million people would be moving by rail and road on that Friday, the busiest day of the year for travelling through Britain. And the motorways that we need to use, which are the, um, the M50, M M6? M6 and uh, the M1 uh, are the one of the busiest. So with regret, I've had to cancel. Uh, but we are going to meet up with friends in the new year. So that'll be really, really good. When we're back from our holiday, um, so that'll be really good. We'll have lots of holiday things to share. <laughs> holiday gossip. Um, so I'll show you a bit of the wind outside. And then I need to upload, finish uploading that video. And that's kind of it for, for today. Relax. I feel like I'm in Christmas holiday. <laughs> I want to just have a few days off. I'm not going to. I need to work. But um, but yeah, I feel like I should be in Christmas holiday mode. It is Saturday the 23rd of December. I've not had my shower yet. I've just got up. I'm still in my loungewear Udi. And Matt's having a shower. Like I say, well, like, like you've seen, we've got all the things that we need for Christmas dinner. So that's really, really good. My parents are coming shortly. They're going to bring the little extendable table that we use when we have more than six people around for dinner. Um, and then we've got to tidy the house, do a little bit of cleaning. I did clean the bathroom yesterday. Matt cleaned, cleaned and tidied up the actual work surface kitchen area yesterday. We need to vacuum dust not in that order uh, i need to get some some washing done just so we've got some clothes get all that dried um, and then i need to do a bit of work a bit of uploading a bit of editing um, and then i think my plan <laughs> matt's off work now he's he's finished work for the christmas period he's back on wednesday the wednesday after christmas um obviously being self-employed i create my own days so I want to get everything done today so that I can have tomorrow, Christmas Eve, off, Christmas Day, off, Boxing Day, off. Then we're both back to work on Wednesday. So I'm trying to get videos uploaded, all ready for that. So once Matt has finished in the shower, once my parents have been, I'm going to get myself showered and then it's crack on with the day. So for the final time this year, here is our Christmas card wreath. So if you have sent us a card, I'm sure you can probably see it somewhere there. Uh, obviously our parents' Christmas cards are, are in the living room. We're a bit pushed for sort of space really when it comes to displaying cards because we haven't got a fireplace with a shelf or anything. So the Christmas card star is where the majority of our Christmas cards end up. So Matt's lovely clean and tidy island and kitchen that was I didn't actually show it you yesterday. I should have vlogged it when it was clean. Did you uh, vlog my cleaning? No, I, did you vlog your cleaning? No. Right. Well, my mom and dad have just delivered a load of things because we don't quite have enough for eight. So we've borrowed some of my parents' wine glasses, some of their serving dishes. I used that. Um, this is a, I think it's a John Lewis candlestick. Uh, we've got the Christmas crackers. I'll show you these now to get a sneak sneak peek. The tablecloth, table runner, and this is just a load of mess that I need to sort out. Um, I also need to catch up on the advent calendar. Right, so catching up on the advents, we have under 20, five days to go, and it's a snowman. Under 21, it's a ho, 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 and it's a Santa. 23rd is a Santa, but he's upside down, so we'll turn him round. Uh, number 19 was a Christmas tree that says, dance around the tree. Right, it's time to close out this week's weekly vlog. Yay. Although it's covered about two or three weeks, to be quite honest. What was that? <laughs> so, it's it's the day before Christmas Eve. How are you feeling? It's Christmas Eve Eve. It's... I am ready for Christmas. We have a Christmas Eve box for the cats. We do, for my mum and dad. Yeah, so that'll be interesting. So, what's going to happen with 
the schedule. I'm not entirely sure. So obviously this is the last vlog before Christmas. We'll be vlogging Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, Boxing Day, and then that week up to New Year's. And yes. I don't know when the next vlog is going to be out. Whether if I stick to my Monday schedule, it's like the 1st of January. Yes. But I'm not sure. So just make sure you're all subscribed yeah. and ready. Right, what else has been going on this week? We've got all the stuff ready for Christmas. And yeah, we're, we're just getting ready. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching this vlog. If you've enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share on social media. And of course, do hit the bell so that you know whenever we upload a new video. So from us, until you all, goodbye. Bye.